and welcome to season two of Live in Love with You, sharing my self-love journey. I have so much to share, so let's rewind the track and start on. Good morning, I'm so excited. I'm finally gonna go do yoga in Bryant Park. All summer long, there are free yoga classes in the middle of the city, so hundreds of yogis will come. But the best part were our instructors. They were so inspirational, like Dan Evans. Without any legs, he was still able to wake up every morning and fulfill his dreams. So inspirational. So I am on my way to support Miss Jasmine Rose and her lock appreciation. My girl, Miss Jasmine Rose, held Brooklyn's first lock appreciation day. I was her photographer. The event was to celebrate locks of all colors, shapes, and sizes. It was pretty dope. We were able to listen to live music, shop, mingle, and even a fashion show. Yes. Yes. <laughs> and there is a wonderful yes. Isn't she beautiful? Her name is Rose Rose. Rose Rosalyn. Rose yeah. See? I'm from Toronto. I know myself. He's also from <laughs> Toronto. Yeah. Boom, boom. Happy luck appreciation day. Woo! So proud of my Jazzy. She did such a good you. job today. Yeah. We described her. She's amazing. Peace. Ow. We finally made it to Carol Fest with my step. Natural in Brooklyn and not go to Curl Fest. Smack dead in the heart of Prospect Park, the slayage is everywhere. <laughs> it's so dope and there's black girl magic everywhere you look, but the best part is when I see my stuffies, the more I walk around, the more I bump right into you guys. and they revamped it so the parties are so dope. Even the bathroom is lit, like, literally. My mommy turned the big 5-0. She's 50 now, and to celebrate her birthday, she wanted to do a vlog. Who does she think she is? <laughs> uh, 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 I'm all the way up. <laughs> My hair didn't make it, but we finally made it to the beach. And those crazy people over there, those people, that's my friends. Let me introduce you Ty, Justin, Diamond, Raven, Stephanie, Janelle, T, Dee Dee, and Petey. Petey has his own t shirt line. I'll leave the links down below. They're pretty dope. And that's just to name a few. We haven't seen each other since graduation, so it was so much fun just to chill, do yoga. It was just good vibes. They're crazy, but I love them. <laughs> happy birthday! I love you so much. Love you. Happy birthday. For my birthday, my friends created this really cute happy birthday video, and they almost made me cry. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. For my birthday, all I wanted to do was eat. So French toast in the morning and vegetarian vegan sushi in the evening. It was so good. <laughs> For her bachelorette, we had the perfect little gift. Hey guys, so if you're under 18, you're gonna have to skip the five minutes. Bye. <laughs> Party is over. <laughs> She's <laughs> so gone. It was fun. Okay, peace out. <laughs> Guys, I met one of my 
is. Her name is Jada. <laughs> Recently, I've been challenging myself to feel the fear but do it anyway. I'm afraid of heights, so I gathered a group of friends to go zip lining with me. We started off with the baby zip line obstacle course, but I was so scared. And it has the baby zip line to get you ready for the big one, but girl, I was so scared. To website, that's supposed to be the biggest one with the biggest zip line. We conquered the other two. <laughs> Once we got to the biggest obstacle course, there was anxiety attacks, panic attacks, but with the support system, anything is possible. Good job. I did this to conquer my fears because I'm afraid of heights. And I don't want to be afraid of things anymore, so. I mean, I kind of a little over my head. I'm doing this to continue to love myself. Feel the fear. Jumped off the tallest tree and it felt so liberating. <laughs> we did it, guys! We did it! We conquered our fears and we zip lined! Oh, oh. We did it! That looks so good! Let go of fear and you'll be amazed at what you can do. So, finally, I'm finally going to try out. Oh. As I was saying, out the natural delicious five in one. <laughs> so cool. I want to try um, a new wash and go um, technique. Um, I shared with you guys my wash and go a long time ago. If you haven't seen it, I'll leave it over here. You guys loved it, but there was some complaints, so I'm gonna try this out because it gives you definition like automatically, which I heard from Discovery Natural. Hey girl. This is step one out of a four-step treatment, and I have the box right here with all of the other um, steps inside of it. But I'm just gonna try this one today just to see um, if this will, you know, help me with my definition. Here are my final results and my no heat wash and go. I think that the curls came out beautiful, and they're so well defined. Today I'm going to the black light slide. This is a really huge slide that is gonna glow up at night. The slides are super, 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 super dope, but the best part is the glow in the dark party at the end. Woo! I just wanted to talk to you guys. I feel like I've failed for the person that I am, for the overachiever that I am. I'm not where I want to be and I feel like I've failed myself. And I feel like I've failed myself educational wise. The fact that I'm not in a PhD program as yet. And then I feel like I failed at YouTube because if I don't put out a video that has something to do with my hair, it's nobody cares and it doesn't get any views. I decided to host a Live in Love with Yogi, which is my new yoga series event. I have 50 slots to fill and I've been advertising this event for nearly a week. My advertisements have reached up to nearly 5,000 of my subbies and only 6 people have RSVP'd. I have 56,000 subscribers. I really thought that it pains me because I thought that this was going to be a success and instead it looks like this is going to be a complete failure. I want to hate myself and be like, who did you think you were to set up this event and you thought that people were just going to start pouring in? Like, who do you think you are? What change did you think you were going to make in the world by hosting this event? My biggest fear is going into that room and nobody's going to be there. Let me tell you something about failure. It is painful, but I would not make it get to me. Can I get <laughs> I am finally going to see Watch Me Through I Love Broadway Musical, so this is basically a dream come true. We were running late but got there just in time. The musical was so amazing. The next weekend, a road trip to Primark. Gagged over the store in London and they finally made one in the States, so I had to check it out. Primark is legit like H&M and Forever 21. If they had a baby, oh crap. <laughs> days later I finally recorded my summer haul for $15 and six hours of labor it turned out pretty good just not sturdy <laughs> after hard work sweat and tears my live in love with yogi self-love yoga event finally came to life wasn't able to fill the room but was able to fill some hearts there was some beautiful souls there and we started off with some support yoga
My favorite part was the self-love workshop. Looking at themselves through the mirror pointed out insecurities and stepped forward when the ones that I said applied to them. Such an eye-opening event. And we finished off with some fun partner yoga. Thank you so much for coming. I love you all so much and I hope to see you at my next one. Time to get some Thai ice cream. I have been eyeing down this place forever. Thai ice cream is a little different in the sense that they make it right in front of you and they roll it up. The Netflix show that's called Get Now, the super dope. Look, look at my friend, y'all. Look at my friend. It's my friend. Woo! Good job, Stan! Woo! Stan! Woo! Today is my friend Sarah's wedding. I got all dolled up for the occasion. The groom, guys. Hey. 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 I'm betting him. Right. That he's going to cry. I won't cry. He's when he sees cry. wifey. He's gonna cry. How do you feel? I'm oh, oh, mad. <laughs> Look at this. Boy. The wedding venue was beautiful and so was my bride and the cake. It was such an amazing wedding. I'm so proud of you guys for falling in love with each other. Congrats. Hey, I'm finally going to be using my hot head from Thermal Hair Care. This is basically a heating conditioning cap. What? So it comes with these really cute hot head deep conditioning caps. Basically, you throw this bad boy into the microwave and you slap it on top of your head so that you can be mobile hey! as you deep condition. I have low porosity hair, so for me, anything that requires heat is best as far as getting the proper deep conditioning treatment for my hair. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I am feeling this, okay? Feeling it. So today is basically like the last day of summer. It's Labor Day weekend. Some of my girls and some of my guys, we all headed to Long Island to have a little end of summer bonfire. Oh, your marshmallow was lit. Oh <laughs> it's lit. It's lit. You gotta pull it out, <laughs> and that concludes the end of this vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't be shy to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, never forget to live in love with you.